Today we're going to make kakra out of leftover rotis. So you see we've prepared there with a cloth uh, so that we can put the hot kakra on it. And now the tawa has been preheated and now we take, uh, you clean the big fresh rotis or you can take leftover rotis and you put it on the tawa and with a cloth you keep pressing on it. So you keep putting pressure on it, making different parts of the roti are getting the heat. You turn it around and you continue putting pressure on it with a cloth. And you turn it around again, flip it and continue pressing. And you turn it around again, flip it and you continue pressing on it, putting pressure on it, a different part of the roti. You notice now that it's not fluffing up anymore. Flip it and keep pressing. And when you hold it now, you'll realize it's already starting to get a bit thick. The two layers have come together and on the heat, they're getting compressed into a nice kakra. See, it's getting a nice color so you keep pressing on it the smell also changes and this is ready so we're going to keep it on the cloth that we kept there and we keep something heavy on it and we start making our next one just to say, we're doing this entire khakra making process on low flame, on sim. And now, in case you have this little amazing tool, you can use this to make your khakras. What it does is it doesn't soak up the ghee. So if you use the cloth, it soaks up the ghee of the rotis that you might have made. But both are totally fine. Just in case you have this tool, you could use it as well. So flip. Press, 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 flip, press, press, press till your cover is ready. And our second kakra is ready so we take away that uh, weight put this next one on it and put back the weight and all our kakras are ready you can see that they've become crisp Ta -da -da. and you can have it with your chai with salsa with uh, pickle with just jeera mirchi namak with ghee and shakkar hope you enjoy it mama also dips it in milk and has kakra it's an amazing snack to make at home. Do try it. Enjoy.